we were sitting around at the beach saying it would be fun to start a brand that kind of represented who we were, which is being based out of New York City. We weren't wearing uh, a lot of what the major surf companies were putting out. We were wearing more New York-based designers following the trends of fashion in New York. We didn't want to like change the surf industry, we just kind of wanted to offer a, a different part. What should we call it? And the first word out of my mouth was Saturdays. Looked around, that sounds good. <laughs> Saturday was always like the best day of the week. It was positive, it was easy to remember. So we just kind of started there. None of us managed a store before. Somebody would come in and try to buy something, and I'd run back and sell a shirt, and then run back, make coffee, and it's like, what am I doing? <laughs> this is insane. What did we just get ourselves into? People started hearing about us and coming by and curious and asking a lot of questions, responding to it. Coming from SCAD with double major in graphic design and photography, those majors definitely play a role in what I'm doing right now. I'm the creative director of Saturdays, and that's managing how we're seen, how we're visualized, from producing the graphics for the clothes, to maintaining our blog, which is a way to let people know what we're doing from all over the world. With our shop, we kind of wanted to work with the vibe of the location and the vibe of the building and what it had to offer. We went to Brooklyn and there's a reclaimed wood place. Uh, it kind of reminds me of a place you'd find in Savannah, actually. We got all these old timbers and we used some of our friends to help build out the space, but we just kind of did everything ourselves. It's a cool, creative space. It's a cool, creative block. And that's been another key part of our success. We wanted to introduce a community kind of vibe to the store. We wanted to bring people in. They wanted to hang out and, and talk and, and socialize and share their experiences. There's a lot of celebrities and, and people that will come by. But at the same time, it feels very real and organic and tangible. It's a comfortable little spot. We're looking to grow. We're looking to go vertical with the Saturday's experience, with the Saturday's lifestyle. And just producing good stuff, stuff that we like and that other people like. And we'll see, we'll see what happens. It's kind of funny, you know, you, can't, you come up here and you're like, all right, I'm in New York now, but I still see a lot of the same <laughs> faces from SCAD. A lot of people have moved up to New York and are doing wonderful things. SCAD gives you the opportunity to produce a great body of work, a solid understanding of where things came from, a history, some experience, a good balance of, of seeing everything. If you want to be in New York or you want to be anywhere, really, it's just making that step. Make the commitment and you'll see what happens, you know? You'll meet people, maybe decide to do something completely different like opening a surf shop. You just gotta give yourself a chance.